Hello there, Kashke community. So in today's video, I can show you the new um, turn lights. I've ordered this one from the eBay or AliExpress. I will give you the link in the description. The thing is that this one looks really nasty and it's really good visible from bigger distance. If I will show you in comparison with the second one. I even don't see him on, on the video. I need to go really closely and from this side and then I can barely see the turn indicator on this old one. And the new one. It's really cool. Cost under 50 euros and the work on it is for like 20 minutes and it's a little bit advanced because you could break a lot of things uh, during the installation but it's not that much bad uh, after the video uh, i can show you some of the pictures what you need to watch out during the installation and i can show you quickly uh, how to do the second one the main point is that you need to turn the uh, mirror the most uh, downwards as you can Space uh, from upper side, and then with the screwdriver, you need to put some clips out. It's not much visible on the video, but there you go. You can see the clips inside, which you need to push it away from the center. Mainly this one in in the center of the camera right now and as well this second one and afterwards use a little bit of the force to move it away same on the left side I just pushed on two middle clips, the smaller ones not the big ones and then when you are in this state you are able to remove it like this after this part you can disconnect the heating of the mirror you need to watch out for the small insurance so let me remove it okay after i've disconnected the mirror from the small insurance and this connector here you need to put down three screws of the engine of the mirror uh, one two and three i'm using this kind of tool to remove it so let's go for it and just these three screws and then the mirror engine uh, will drop down it's still connected to the cable so you will not break it uh. okay so after three screws are out from the mirror engine uh, i would recommend you to put the screws to the side because i've lost already one so i had to use the spare one which doesn't fit for 100% so learn from my mistakes and right now you need to uh, put down the white parts of the mirror in my case uh, the main point is you should definitely not care about this clip inside you need to take care only about uh, from the inside one two three four in in the corner and these two bigger ones not about the others so then i will go for it only with the finger okay two hands need it so these two are the main ones and one two three four the smaller ones just release them and it should go uh, down easily okay and now essential part when uh, the clips are released uh, from the inside one when the clips are released from the main parts that you are in a state like this you need to watch out because there is still one clip here in this place so, okay and this is the most difficult part because there is one clip so i had to use two hands somehow like this to put it inside because there is still one small hidden clip and you need to push this one towards you in order to not break this small triangle i've damaged him a little bit 
but if you will use this tool exactly how you should that it will pull it towards to you it's easy to disassemble it okay and now the easy work just two screws from the turn signal and replace it for the new one from the china there is a little bit problem because the connector from the china when i disconnect it just like this with my bare hand it doesn't fit to the one completely different and connect the cables properly between themselves i did it like this that i've uh, disassembled this original nissan connector by pushing on these two silver clips put the wires out and put them inside uh, of the not correct connector so i've connected it somehow and put a lot of uh, isolation tape uh, around it because you can risk that some water will get inside so it's up to you how you will connect it or if you will find out some kind of reduction or you will, I will complain at the China on the order that he should uh, use different connector. I will send him the picture of this one that okay it doesn't fit. Uh, you even cannot use it somehow with different because it's completely on this cable like this. I've even uh, tried to get in uh, what's here inside. Uh, don't uh, do that. It's only uh, some electronic part inside and for the cable directly to the china light uh, it's directly to the light there is not some kind of connector like on the original one so somehow improvise and connect it between themselves so see you soon at the next video uh, have a look on a few photos i will mark you the essential parts uh, on the photos and see you soon again and as always if you want to support me please subscribe thank you goodbye Nice work after with both lights replaced and assembled. Pretty cool and visible from the all angles. Really like it. See you soon. Goodbye.